and have other worse, worse effects. The treatment that we developed um, is a, uh, to use um, a fairly commonly, now commonly available compound called capsaicum. And capsaicum is the um, active ingredient in chili peppers. Um, and that's what makes them hot. Um, and um, it has a most unusual property is that capsaicum also kills those C fibers we were talking about, um, which are the pain and fibers that are in fact driving the trigeminal neuralgia. So what we do is you basically get rid of this input um, and you're not affecting the other sensory effects. The rest of my face feels absolutely normal, but those pain fibers have disappeared. They, uh, we've managed to get rid of them. But it's not a total panacea because if you have very, very badly damaged um, uh, mouth, for instance, um, the dentist has taken out too many teeth and or you, you, you can get to the point where you can't actually fix it. It's no, it is no longer fixable. So to do this, you'll probably need the help of your dentist um, because your, there's, your dentist actually has to make what is known as an impression of your mouth and the dentist will come up with something that looks like this, which is a um, dental impression. It's not my one, somebody else's. That's all righty. Uh, and um, then with the dental impression, we then use that to make a mouth guard. Um, you can buy mouth guard material for sports guards. You can get them at the, at the, um, at the drug store, at the pharmacy, um, or at sports stores. And um, they give you instructions on basically how to heat them and force them down. And you push them so they go right down, right close to the gum line. So you want to, be, you want to be, get, have cover all this completely. The mouth guard's job is to allow us to apply the capsaicum onto the um, inner lining of the mouth on the gums. I might call the mucosa. We then glue onto the, um, uh, we, we cut pads, right? This is a synthetic cloth um, and you glue them. You can see how we've done it here. You glue them on the outside and on the inside of the affected area. What we get from the, the um, manufacturer um, or the supplier is 40% capsaicum. Uh, so we need to, to dilute this one part in four. Um, so we put in one drop of capsaicum and then we mix it with four drops of rubbing alcohol. It doesn't have to be completely accurate so long as it's something up, up something like 10% it'll be fine. So you take four drops out of here and drop it in there and then swirl that around, mix it and that is going to be the material you're going to put on the pad. The next part of this is a good idea, you do it over a sink in the bathroom or as I'm going to do it now in the lovely sunny garden here at Cape Tribulation, uh, do it out in the garden because you're going to spit and drool a lot. The capsaicum really makes you salivate. We have to make sure that by the time you're finished, you have your nice glass of milk to rinse your mouth out with because it just takes away the pain of the capsaicum. And then this is going to hurt. So you should do it for about half an hour every day for about four. As, as the pain disappears on application, you know that you're winning. It is that the, the, the nerves are, are starting to, to go. And then what you do is put it in some water and you have to make sure you rinse it up and clean it really thoroughly before you use it tomorrow for your next, next use. After four applications, my neuralgia disappeared permanently. And I've had no, no side effects from it. My, this both sides of the mouth feel almost identical and I'm now completely symptom free. I've been so for five years now. So I won and I hope you'll win too.